Welcome back to the Skyway. This is the last group of the semi-finals. Two drivers have already advanced on to the championship round and only two slots remain. Based on the standings, this is the fastest group on the Skyway. This should be good. Stetson Horn driving in the SRT Viper GTSR weighing 30.1 grams. Gale Force driving in a Ford GT40 weighing 36.8 grams. Jonas Fang driving in the Porsche 911 GT3 RS weighing 51.5 grams. And Cannonball Claire driving in a BMW M3 GT2 weighing 32.1 grams. Two American, two German, contemporary speed and a dash of classic. Jonas Fang down front, next to Stetson Horn starting today in pole position. Cannonball Claire and Gale Force in the back. And they're off. Group staying tight into the 45. Horn pops ahead, Fang fighting. Stetson Horn's lead is growing. He flips in the turn. Fang clears it. Claire two. Wow. Fang taking race one. Force passes Horn at the finish and Horn manages to cross the finish line as well. Stetson Horn doing his best flipping in this Viper. Mid turn two. Pulled back up the banking wall. Flipping onto his hood. But watch Fang drift and cut round Horn. Cannonball Claire as well like choreography. Force is caught behind Horn. Pushing him but in the last moments is able to pull ahead. At least Stetson Horn posted a point given the circumstances. A DNF in the semi finals. That will set you back. Jonas Fang navigated tragedy on the tarmac with such precision. Hold stop spot. Starting race two now in pole position. Gale forced by his side. Hopefully Stetson Horn can keep his wheels on the ground. And they're off. Fang already edging ahead. Out the 45, solidifying his lead. Leaving turn one, single file. Force cutting on the inside. Whoa, Force is gone. What happened? So fast. Jonas Fang taking race two, followed by Stetson Horn and Cannonball Claire. What happened? Right out of turn one, Gale Force cuts the wheel, squaring up to pass on the inside. Fang feels the approach, cuts the wheel, checking Force up onto the wall, grinding into the concrete barrier, and pow! Firing Force backwards, up and out of frame. Look at that, an unstoppable Force meeting an immovable object. Jonas Fang leading with 10 points, two wins in a row. Cannonball Claire with half that, Horn with four points, and a bummer indeed for Gale Force. She must be shaken up after that. Riding now in pole position, let's see if she can earn back some of those points. But the competition is steep considering she's going head to head with the Cannonball herself. And they're off, neck and neck into the 45. Force and Fang pulling ahead into turn one. Single fire as Force holds the lead. Fang is wily. Force drifting into the 90, slowing, maintaining, and Gale Force takes race three, followed by Fang, Claire, and Horn. A quick look at Cannonball Claire going into turn one, catching an edge, nearly vertical, nearly flipping, but she finds her footing. The same can be said for Fang as well. A few drifts and fishtails, diminishing speed, allowing Force to stay ahead. Here we go, headed into race four, and Jonas Fang has already earned his spot in the final round with 13 points. Congratulations. Cannonball Claire with the advantage, starting in pole position. Stetson Horn by her side. And they're off. Into the 45, Claire bumped by Force. Horn flips, Force caught behind, oh no! The Cannonball with a growing lead, clean through turn two. Straight and narrow, Cannonball Claire takes race four, followed by Force. Jonas Fang, and I suppose that's it. Any chance Force had was dashed when Horn flipped in turn one. Force needing every inch and was set back a mile. And there you have it, Cannonball Claire will be joining Jonas Fang in the final round of the 2024 Skyway Grand Prix. Horn and Force, thanks for the racing. And just like that, only four drivers remain, and with the glory of the championship just around the corner, the racing will only get more dynamic from here. Until next time, drive safely and always take the high road.